Hello, welcome to Cosmos and our demonstration on how to connect your Loyverse point of sale with eSync and add your shopping carts like WooCommerce or Shopify. Cosmos eSync connects your shops, restaurants, bars, retail store to accounting, point of sale, ERP, CRM, and marketplaces. It's easy with eSync. Simply click Start Your Free Trial, fill out the form, and begin your free trial. You can also connect your app from the Loyverse website. Connect that. From our website, you will see the login page at the very top. Click login and login with your username and password you created. You'll notice there aren't any actions yet. Actions are the operations you need to connect uh, between systems. Those include inventory sync, matrix sync, and creating orders. To create your actions, you also need to create your systems. Let's choose waivers. Now you want to grant the access and follow the instructions. Cosmos waivers. Next. Log into your account and allow. You now will see your Loy versus connected. Now choose your next system. Let's collect WooCommerce. Grant access. Follow instructions to your right. Give your WooCommerce store name. Enter your URL. Now you need to enter your consumer key and secret. The instructions to your right will inform you how to find your key and secret. Simply click on WooCommerce settings. Advanced and REST API. Add a key. Provide read and write permissions. Generate your key. Now copy into your dashboard. Access account. We are now connected to WooCommerce. Click continue. Click Loyverse. Continue. And add your actions to your list. We're going to start with send standard items. Send standard items. Hit save, and now configure Loyverse to WooCommerce. Go back two days, give a store ID, and skewer barcode. Now create your task, add your action, send standard Loyverse to WooCommerce, give a name, and turn on your schedule with paid subscriptions. With trials, they're unavailable. Hit run. And while it's running, click on WooCommerce and Product. Complete. Now let's hit refresh. You can see we have new products created in WooCommerce. You'll notice the products were created without stock. Now you'll need to add the action to send inventory levels for standard items. Action, create action, commerce, Loyverse. Now send inventory levels for standard items. Inventory levels for standard. Continue. Save. Action. Figure. Let's go back a couple days. Give a store ID. For example. And skew. Save. Now create task. Add action. Send standard to WooCommerce. Send standard inventory to Woo. Hit save. Now run your task. Complete. Now let's hit refresh. You'll notice one product has updated with eight inventory. Since we're only going back 48 hours, only stock that has been adjusted in 48 hours would sink. So you notice the inventory has adjusted for lower standard. If you wanted to update the inventory for, say, the Nike hat, which is out of stock, with this SKU, let's update that item. hat, skew matches, and let's adjust inventory for a location. You'll see the, the inventory at Portland is 85. Complete. Hit refresh.
total inventory 851. You can see the, the inventory at Portland is 851, and that's because we chose the, the establishment location ID for our inventory sync. We click settings, stores, and Portland. Our ID number for Portland here ends in 41. That ID number, our store ID number, will match our inventory store ID number for inventory sync, ending in 401. That's it. If you have any questions, please contact us at cosmocentral.com with a K. Feel free to schedule a consultation at any time. We can also support multi-location inventory sync, multi-location order sync, omni-channel, loyalty. If you have a connection you'd like us to review, please contact us and let us know. Thank you. And start your free trial today.